much, Chris. Okay, new at five. Have you heard of transcript ransom? We're talking about colleges withholding that crucial transcript from grads if they still owe the school money, and many grads need that transcript to get a job after graduation. So now there's a new bill in the legislature that aims to change that. 11 Alive's Doug Richards spoke with the sponsor today about why he feels the move is necessary. Every year, tens of thousands of students spend money to pay the costs of college. When they come up short, Georgia colleges and universities can withhold college transcripts from graduates as leverage to get them to pay up. So while I understand certainly the interest in uh, encouraging, incentivizing, and ultimately requiring students to pay off their debt, I just don't believe that uh, their transcript should be held for these purposes, these specific purposes. State Representative Marvin Lim has written a bill that would eliminate the power of colleges to engage in what's become known as transcript ransom to force graduates to pay their bills. These students need employment in order to be able to earn income in order to be, be able to uh, excuse me pay off their debt but without in many cases their transcripts they're not able to secure these jobs limbs bill would prohibit colleges from withholding transcripts from indebted students or their potential employers Lim says the measure would not only help graduating students but in a world where employees are often hard to find, it would also clear an obstacle for workplaces to hire qualified workers. Lim is a Democrat, but his college transcript bill has more co-sponsors from the Republican majority than it does from Democrats. In DeKalb County, Doug Richards, 11 Alive News.